on the floor for the visiting Dallas Mavericks. At small forward, Reggie Bullock. At shooting guard, Tim Hardaway Jr. At the other forward position, Dorian Finney-Smith. At center, Christian Wood. At the other guard position, Luka Doncic. The head coach of the visiting team is Jason Kidd. Grant Hill and Clark Kellogg. Our reporter is Allie LaForce. Allie, take it away. Well, Brian, the Heat are united. Coach Spolstra said, quote, it's not about stats with these guys, and that's so unique. You can talk about it, you can teach it, you can rant as much as you want, but this league is based on celebrating a lot of other things, and rightfully so, but ultimately, it's about winning. There it is. Thanks, Allie. Looking at the starting five for the Dallas Mavericks. Doncic and Hardaway Jr. man the backcourt. Benny Smith plays the four with Wood at center. And it's Bullock in at small forward. And for Miami, Struess and Butler out on the perimeter. Caleb Martin out there with Bam Adebayo. And it's Lowry in at the point. After 13 seasons with Rick Carlisle in charge, the Mavs changed their head coach in 2021, Clark. Hiring Jason Kidd, B.A., and a he was a member of that 2011 title team. That was a lot of fun to watch. We saw Dallas dedicated to the defensive end under Jason Kidd's leadership. A new voice brought new energy and a refocus, and we'll see if that can be sustained going forward. Now here's Butler. Here's Adebayo. Perfect pass to set up the lay-in. Boy, a fine passer in his position. Jimmy Butler recognizes when his teammates are open and how to get the ball to him. Now here's Doncic. Wood left side. Falls. Great setup by Doncic. Just taking it right to the rim, and no one was there to greet him. Well, this early, they should be showing a lot more energy on defense. It's not there. Now here's Lowry. Pass to Adebayo. Clock at six. Double team on Butler. The Heat need to get one up in a hurry. Lowry, good. Well, Lowry can just pepper you with shots from the arc. He's got a talent for finding and making those looks. Hard away with it. Here's Bullock. They set a pick. Inside. Here's Finney Smith. And that one goes. Feeding him with a lead pass. 
Finney Smith has a real good handle on his role in this offense. Takes high percentage shots consistently. Outside Struess. Out of bio, a screen on Hardaway. And he's going for the oop here. And what I love about Adebayo is he picks smart shots to take. Just an efficient offensive player. Here's Hardaway. Pass to Bullock. Parked it down low that time. Got hit with the three-second call. The Heat have gone three of three so far from the floor. Martin with the ball. Here in the first, just under two and a half minutes played so far to the paint. Out of bio against Wood. Double team on Butler. Lowry outside. Good, and Butler gets the assist. Lowry's got six. Smart move going to Lowry, a talented shooter who doesn't hesitate on his shots. Yeah, and Kyle Lowry has always used his stocky build to his advantage. But coming into this season, the Heat said he'd have to address this conditioning. Attacking in the painted area. Clearly that was their game plan coming in. Now Lowry. He's got six. Adebayo passes to Butler. Back to Adebayo. Pass to Lowry. And there's a three-second violation. The Heat making a switch here. Heroes checked in. Now in the game, Tyler Hero. The Mavericks trailing. Just under three and a half minutes elapsed here in the first quarter. Back to Doncic. Wood outside. Here's the teardrop. That's good from Hardaway on the assist by Wood. Grant, we saw in last year's playoffs, the hamstring injury hampered Lowry. It really did. I mean, he plays a physical style, getting in there and taking charges. And as he enters his late 30s, staying in peak condition could help him withstand the rigors of the season. Here's Hero. Banked it in off the glass. For a center, Adebayo is an excellent passer. He's always so aware of his surroundings. We've got a minute 48 left in the first quarter of the game. Down low. Bullock. Good. I like the play call. Very solid. Making perfect use of the pick to get a great look. The Heat have gone 5 of 5 in this quarter. Solid. Hero outside. Adebayo a screen on Hardaway. Hero outside. Pass to Adebayo. Count it. All three of his attempts have gone in. The explosiveness off the screen. I mean... Bam, so good at knowing where to roll to after setting picks. And here's Hardaway. Doncic, right side. Up and over Lowry. Another one falls for Dallas. You know, Luka's one of those players where the mid-range shot is really a weapon for him. Not just an afterthought. I mean, he is lights out from that distance. Lowry, the pass to Adebayo. And here's Butler. Adebayo sets a screen. Butler with the ball. Guarded now by Wood. And yep, it's good. Adebayo's got eight. And Butler's so proficient at running the pick and roll. Excellent at taking what the defense gives him. And he gets those passes around defenders quite sweetly. Now here's Hardaway. To the middle. From the right block. Two shots, two makes. Off to a good start. Luka Doncic. 19 seconds left in the first quarter. Hardaway against Hero. A 
up in time. Oh, he beats the buzzer just in time. Wow. Big time bucket, I'll tell you. Great clock management there. An ideal way to end the quarter with momentum on your side. Bam Adebayo has been leading the charge for Miami. Eight points in the quarter, showing how effective he can be. And more NBA action on 2K Sports, coming your way right after this. through one quarter in this one and a look at how the offensive approach has been going so far for Miami well we're in the era of the three-point basket so if you want to win games in this league you have to connect from deep and they have been thus far and you know in no time at all they've also started finding points inside already taking apart that interior defense you know some have said those old school power forwards guys like Charles Oakley they're becoming outdated. You see that, Grant? Well, first of all, the physicality in the game is no more. The way Oakley would hit you and bruise you, you can't do that in today's game. And guys like Oakley are now playing the five position, and they're shooting three-pointers. So a lot of it just is because the game has changed and evolved since the 90s when Oakley dominated. Great skill level in the game right now. No question. Taking a look at the Mavericks. And heading the backboard, it'll be Doncic and Dinwiddie. JaVale McGee out there with Dwight Powell. And it's Finney Smith in at the three, the small forward. Now here's Hero. He's got five. Clock is at three. Shoots over Dinwiddie. Hero with the bucket. Hero's got seven. You've got to appreciate the consistency. Night in and night out, he brings it. Pass to McGee. Back to Doncic. Right side, Finney Smith. The shot is good. Doncic making the play. Doncic has got three assists now in this one. Doncic taking pride in setting the table for his teammates. I love his unselfishness. And Grant, no team better than Miami in developing undrafted prospects. I mean, for key roles, too. You look at last year's playoffs. Struess, Martin, Vincent, Robinson. It's allowed Miami to stay on top in a salary cap driven lead. Able to get to the hoop with those nice handles leading to an easy finish. And that streaking rack attack is the mobile one drive. And I love the way he played downhill on that drive. Love the attack mentality in a close game. Now here's Dinwiddie looking for his first basket still in this one. Powell sets a screen. Doncic with it. Now guarded by Butler. And the shot goes. That's just a fantastic decision from Doncic. Seeing a chance to go to work inside and taking it. Dinwiddie against Hero. Pass to Butler. To the inside. Adebayo. Who's locked in. Dreams his fifth shot in his many attempts. And once Bam gets the ball inside, the bucket is almost guaranteed. He's a serious producer in the paint. Second quarter play, almost three minutes gone here. Doncic passes to Dinwiddie. Dallas needs to get off a shot. Takes the three. Drills it from deep. Spencer Dinwiddie's got himself going here. His first point of the game on the deep ball. Defensively, got to close out a little faster. That's a look he'll make with regularity. Adebayo against McGee. Now here's Hero. Guarded closely. Again gets it to go. He can't miss. Five for five. No defensive pressure at all. I mean... That's not going to get it done against him. Hero against Dinwiddie. Doncic outside. Up and in on the layup. Doncic has got eight. Credit their discipline. They've been working for high percentage shots. And here in the second quarter of action, as we approach four minutes played, Hero, left side. 
Oladipo outside. Over Finney Smith. And again, it's Miami converting. You have to respect Oladipo's jump shot now. I mean, he is a skilled mid-range shooter who likes to shoot it from there. And keeping us updated from the sideline, Allie LaForce. Well, guys, Jimmy Butler's focus is all on team success. In fact, his agent said whenever he calls Jimmy to congratulate him on personal accolades, like All-NBA Team, for example, Jimmy hangs up in his face before he can finish his sentence. Brian for Butler, there's only one prize that really matters. Yeah, he's a rare breed, Allie, for sure. Thanks for that. And you look at the intangibles of Luka Doncic. He has some of the best court awareness in the league, and that shows up most with his passing and body control. Now here's Butler. That one's good for two. And over time, he's been a work in progress, but Butler has developed a solid jumper. I mean, when he's got his feet up under him, he's a knockdown scorer, folks. Here's Dinwiddie. Doncic, a screen on hero. Powell outside. Doncic on the wing. Nineteen footer. Basket's good. Luka Doncic has got eight points here in the quarter. You know, what makes Luka so special and lethal is that he has the ability and the knack for taking over games at the most opportune time. Now here's Hero. 11 points in the game. Adebayo passes to Hero. Takes one from 10 feet. And again, it's Miami converting. No trouble converting that. Great look. Nine seconds separating the shot clock and game clock. Hero against Dinwiddie. There's a the screen. And they doubled up Doncic. Pass to Finney Smith. Powell outside. McGee a screen. Powell passes to McGee. He hits it just before the shot clock expires. I like the fact that McGee not just going through the motions here. I mean, setting a good solid screen, timing his roll perfectly. That's um, basketball.